The department hasn't had a strategic plan since 2019. That was pre-pandemic, and we know our world has certainly changed since then. I think the public understands a lot more about public health and what we do, and their expectations are really high, not only for disease control, like we did during the pandemic, but also things like climate change, air quality, and water quality. We've got an opioid epidemic, gun violence has been increasing. And so these are all things that the public health field addresses. We really just want to you know, be prepared to respond as best we can over the next four years. Because we wanted the plan, the strategic plan itself, to be a cornerstone for how we do business going forward, employee voice and inclusion was very primary for us. The public health field attracts people because they're passionate. They want to affect change, and at CDPHE, we are making a difference. For me, truly, it does mean seeing shifts in that data and seeing improvements in the health and the lives of people in Colorado. The strategic plan has been built with data and performance in mind. We love this idea of being able to think critically about the work we do and use data to improve and best serve our customers across the board. Everything that we do can be improved somehow in some way. So what does success look like? Success looks like constant building and constant improvement. Success for this plan is really truly developing a system where um, if something's happening or if there's a need that those local public health agencies know that they can come to CDPHE or CDPHE can go to those local public health agencies. So I think that interconnected system is a crucial component of success. Success really looks like people can see themselves in the plan and that we can learn and be agile from year to year so we can continue to do great work together. I look forward to working with you and everyone at CDPHE to take this plan to the next level.